WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento giving a little mid-morning update of what's happening in the stock market, and we're rocking and rolling over there, folks. We've had a really strong market this morning early with the Dow Jones up about 250 points, and then it immediately reversed and dropped 250 points. It's setting down now about, oh, four or 500 points under the high. S&P made a little bit higher high than yesterday. The NASDAQ didn't even come close. And neither did the uh, the Russell. Uh, actually, the Russell did come close. It took it out by by just a little bit, but no, nothing dramatic. Uh, gold has uh, had a little bit of a rally here. We made a low of 16.33 uh, last night. We rallied up almost to the exact 61% retracement at 16.62. The high was 16.60, and we're trading around 16.48 right now. And we still believe that that's got a little bit of a downward bias. Uh, in the news, of course, they're talking about, uh, you know, the COVID restrictions over in China. That was the real reason for the rally, they said, early in the morning on Bloomberg, because they were going to review all restrictions or take all restrictions away in China. That proved to be a non-starter. In other words, it was false uh, information. Everybody's talking about our election that comes up, I believe it's a week from today. Always an exciting time because you know what happens right after the election, folks? They start talking about the election in 2024. So just to sit back and enjoy it, it's almost like Comedy Central over there on all the channels. I mean, it's just amazing the stuff that's put on there. And you know what's even more amazing? People actually enjoy watching that. I happen to not be one of them because I, <laughs> I'll tell you, it's a little scary when you see it on what's going on here. But anyway, those are just a few things that are going on. Uh, in the world. There was one other thing, and that was the thing with the Russian grain. Evidently, that was blown a little bit out of proportions also, that maybe it was not exactly what Russia meant, because grain is still coming out of the Crimea. And for that reason, we've had a sell-off now uh, in the grain. So it's up on one day, down on the next. It's what you like to see. It's the old Chinese curse, folks. <laughs> Be careful what you ask for. You just might get it. The Chinese curse, I believe, is, uh, oh, dear, I can't even remember what it was. Son of a gun. And here I, I read Lao Tzu all the time, and I, uh, oh, my gosh, I just can't remember it. That's a bad sign for today. Anyway, hopefully I'll remember some of these things related to the market. 877-927-6648. Damn <laughs> 